to access access. Here we are at the AMC Norwalk 20. And for me personally, it's been about 20 years since the last time I was in here. I remember watching X-Men, so that tells you how long I've been here. Let's take a look around and see what the changes are in this theater and any posters they have for up and coming movies. Let's go take a look. Here we have Adam's Family 2, which I think will be released uh, on Paramount Plus, if I'm not mistaken. If I am mistaken, let me know down in the comments below so we can double check that. So far, so good. I mean, like, I love this place. And hold on, let's go some more digging around. Free guy right here. Excellent movie, definitely worth watching. Trust me, you'll get a lot of laughs out of that one. West Side Story. That one's definitely on my to-do list for watch. And then yes, the classic, Transformers the movie. Oh, so long seen that one. Hmm, I think I'm gonna get me a ticket for that one. Maybe, but who knows. Then we have James Bond, which is currently slated for later on this year, hopefully they don't delay it due to COVID. And I'm, I'm waiting for all the changes that are gonna happen soon with that one. The Eternals, another one on my to-do list. The last duo looks interesting. Let's see how that one turns out. And of course, Halloween Kills. This one's definitely on my to-do list and this one will for sure be having a small video on the review. Then we have Shang-Chi right here. Another one that will be um, on my list and a definite review on that one. And of course, Ghostbusters Afterlife. So this one will definitely be on my list. And I can't wait for this one. I'm already getting the actual nostalgia vibes on this one. So far, it's a nice little theater. I mean, 20 auditoriums, pretty good, pretty good. Everything's spaced out nicely. It's very empty for a Friday, uh, Friday afternoon right now, which is good, except I'm expecting the chaos later on. And let's continue to the second side, shall we? Then over there, another poster for Shang-Chi on IMAX. So, hmm, something definitely to check out for that one. Of course, the freestyle machines are here. IMAX once again, Doubly Cinema. And then more posters for Shang-Chi and to, uh, for James Bond right here. Let's see what we have around the corner, shall we? Okay, Dune. This one I'm kind of on the fence on. Let's see. Maybe, maybe not. Just uh, I think when it gets closer, I'll probably decide whether or not to watch it or just or skip it altogether. Thing two right here, and of course Venom. This one's so many yes, no, yes, no. Back in the theaters, back on streaming. So hopefully soon they'll decide if it's going to be officially. But based on the poster, it should be in the theaters soon. And of course, Halloween right here. The card counter. Hmm. I don't know. I have no, no information about that one. So let's see how that one goes. Then Clifford. Uh, for Clifford, I'm kind of unsure about it because it is one of you know the books that I remember reading as a kid. So hopefully they don't mess it up. Of course, like with anything for live action, it's either a hit or a miss. So hopefully. Clifford will be uh, an actual hit. Now let's see what else we have around the theater.
that's pretty much it right here. On this side, I guess it's pretty empty. Kind of unusual, they don't have that many posters. However, I guess right now with the limited releases ha happening, they'll probably add some more posters later. So, what does everyone think of the AMC Norwalk 20? It's big, spacious, 20 auditoriums, which is I like. One, one in Dobley, I think two in IMAX, so definitely worth checking out. And as for me, I'm about to go see my movie right now. So for now, everyone be safe, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.